Hi, this is Amy Wong. I was doing my reading just now and I came across this short story which I thought that I would want to share with everyone here. And this will serve as a very good reminder, especially to entrepreneurs and leaders, including myself. So here you are, stay tuned. Here is how the story goes. A Zen master received a university professor who came to inquire about Zen. The master served tea, filling his visitor's cup to the brim and continued pouring. The professor watched him until he could no longer restrain himself. It's full! It's full! No more will go in! The master said, like this cup, you are full of your own opinions and speculations. How can I show you Zen unless you first empty your cup? Well, this story reminds myself that I was once full of myself, thinking that I know a lot and stopping others from filling up my cup. And when I read this story, it also reminds me one of my teachers also said that there are three words that we cannot have in our dictionary when somebody is teaching us, trying to teach us something. And that three word is, I know that. And whenever we say, I know that, we are stopping ourselves from learning new things from other people. Instead of saying, I know that, show gratitude to the person that tried to fill up my cup by saying, thank you, I've learned something new today. Or thank you for sharing. Even things that you've heard before, just show gratitude and say thank you so that people will continue to fill up our cups. And with that, I also want to share with you a quote that I got from a book that I'm reading now. It's year 2020 version of Rich Dad Poor Dad with updates for today's world. And there's a quote shared by Robert Kiyosaki. He says, this quote from futurist Alvin Toffler says, the illiterate of the 21st century will not be those who cannot read and write, but those who cannot learn, unlearn and relearn. Hope this helps.